So why do I say that our data is not secure? Because every single one of our devices betray us. Anyone here turn off your Wi-Fi when you came in? Your Bluetooth? It's all beaconing out all the time. Uh, it's once that happens, that unique address, I can follow you around forever. I actually did a study. I was curious because at, you know, where I'm from back in Maryland, in the university I did my research at, was the first school to get certified by the National Security Agency. So we're about seven miles away from NSA in Fort Meade. And there's this Dunkin' Donuts that's there. And so over the course of four weeks, I went there four Mondays in a row between 7 a.m. and 9 a.m. <clears throat> I got people's home address because they would put their SSID as that. I knew where they worked. Um, at that particular point, I know you're at work and I had your home address. I can just go to your house. Um, I can actually follow them around because you're just going to constantly keep beaconing out. So you want to make sure that these things are turned off if you're not using them. I mean, that's really what we do in all, all of security. If the port is not needed, you disable it. You know how many people don't do that? A lot. You know, the, I have been you know, going through New York, um, actually, forget New York, probably the, the worst example, it was at an airport in Tokyo. The amount of devices that are just beaconing out all the time I sometimes think, why do I have to have a conscience? If I had a conscience, maybe I, you know, if I didn't have a conscience, maybe I could be in Belize right now.